Hey everyone, welcome to week 24. I am 24 weeks and three days. I'm so sorry if I sound really funny, but my nose is like crazy stuffed up right now. <laughs> uh, let's see. Not too much has changed since my 23 week video. However, um, I did have a little bit of a scare last night. Uh, so probably due to my iPhone, because I don't think normally that any of this would have concerned me. I probably just would have brushed it off. But um, so I was looking at my iPhone and my what to expect app was like, oh, well, you're 24 weeks now, so you need to start looking out for signs of preterm labor. So I was like, okay. So, you know, I read all the symptoms and then of course, you know, hypochondriacs start getting them. But, uh, so one of the things it said to look for was like, you know, that your mucus plug or whatever. Now I've never seen one before, so I didn't know what to, that I was supposed to be looking for, but I was like, okay, sure. Mucus plug. It said it would be this gross bloody thing. So I was like, okay, well I haven't had that. So anyways, um, this is TMI by the way, so if y'all don't want to hear this part, I suggest you fast forward a little bit. Um, but so anyways, I go to the bathroom, and uh, when I went to go wipe, I saw on the toilet paper that there was like, I don't know, it, was, it wasn't very much. It was very thin. It was about this long, and it was just like a little string of... Um, I get. I don't know. I guess it was a different type of discharge. I don't know. It it looked like snot, kind of. Yeah, it looked like snot, as if you had snot between your fingers and then you you stretched it and pulled it apart. That's what it looked like. It was clear, and it looked like snot, and um, and it was very. It was dry. It wasn't wet, and if you were and if you grabbed it, you could like pull it, and it wouldn't break. Kind of like a rubber band. So. I was like, okay, well, that's really weird. It was like a dry, rubber bandy, clear, snotty booger thing. <laughs> um, but it was, it was really like seriously, it was so small, and it was just a, a string. But even still, you know, I hadn't had that kind of discharge yet, so it really worried me because I'm like, I'm supposed to be looking for this mucus plug, which the app described as like snot or something like that, and I was like, well, this looks like snot to me, and. I didn't know what I was supposed to be looking for, but so that scared me a lot. And uh, so I looked at my app again, and it was like, okay, but you know, if you're not experiencing any pain, or if there's no blood or pink or anything like that, you don't have to worry. So I was like, okay, not worried. So anyways, I go to make dinner, and while I'm making dinner, I start getting this pain in my stomach. And I mean, it wasn't like all over, it was just in one spot. Um, I'll just show you. I'll take this time to show you my belly at the same time. So anyways. Here's the week 24 belly. I don't feel any bigger than last week. But anyways, here, I'll show you where the pain was. It was like right there. One spot, just right there. And I can't describe it any other way than it just felt like, I don't know. The pain was like on a scale of 1 to 10, like a, a 3 or a 4. And it just, I don't know. It felt like a hard, bony thing was just pushing up against my skin, and it, and it just hurt. Um, but it wasn't like, it didn't really hurt that much. It was just an irritating, nagging kind of a, uh, amount of pain. So I kept trying to rub it, and uh, I thought maybe it was Ian and just his foot or something weird pressing up against right there. And I just wanted him to move it, but... I don't know. It, it never did stop last night. Um, well, it, it went away for a little bit. Neil put his face up against my stomach and like said really loud. He's like, Ian, move. You're hurting your mom. And uh, I guess it was loud because as soon as Neil started talking, you could just see my whole belly move. Ian was over here and he just completely moved to this side. Um, and when he did that, the pain went away. But uh it came back again, so I don't know whether it's just that he moved back into his comfortable position where he was before, or if it was something else, but like I said, on a scale of 1 to 10, the pain was around a 3. It wasn't that bad. It's just irritating, and after reading the, my app and after, you know, seeing that thing on the toilet paper, it was just really freaking me out, but uh, 
you know, I went to sleep and this morning it's gone. I don't feel it anymore. So, so yeah. Any of you ever experienced that? Just like a pain in one particular spot? Like, it wasn't like cramps or anything. It was just one spot hurt. Um, or like that stringy thing I was talking about. But anyways, that's all that's been happening in week 24. And it was just last night. Um, other than that, I really don't have any updates. I, uh, yeah. Um, my weight at my last doctor's appointment was 111. And I weighed myself this morning. And I was 112.4, I think. And that was before eating anything. Actually, I still haven't eaten anything yet today. So, yeah, I need to go eat. I'm starving. Um, so, that's it for, for baby stuff. I did get my fuzzy bun diapers in the mail. I was so excited. Um, well, they're fuzzy buns and bum genius. So, I will... Actually, I was going to show you each one because I have the box right here full of them. But I'm just going to insert some pictures so that you can see. I took the pictures when I got the box. So I'll insert them now. And uh, yeah, so that was really exciting. I have 18 cloth diapers. I just need, well, I guess I don't need, but I wanted to have 24 total so that I could do laundry every other day. And uh, the other six diapers I want to get are the Nikki's Best Bottom diapers. I've just been waiting for them to have the stay dry inserts available. So, so yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's it for that. Um, all I need left, I guess, is like a wet bag and um, a diaper sprayer. I don't think, oh, and some rock and green detergent. I need to buy that. I did want to thank Sasha for, she had a giveaway, a Comfy Rumps giveaway, and I was one of the winners, and it was so exciting. I had completely forgotten that I had entered, and so, you know, when I watched the video, I was just, I was really shocked, <laughs> and so it was, it was a huge surprise, it was a great surprise, and so I just want to say thank you to you, Sasha, and also to Comfy Rumps, and, um... I think that's it for week 24. So, yeah. I hope you guys are having an awesome week. I will see you for week 25. And I am going to go ahead and do the Christmas tag now. So, see you guys later. Bye!